Alright guys, this is Zef here, bringing you another video on the Xperia S. Now, what I'm gonna do this time round is pretty much a synthetic battery benchmark. Received a few complaint notes from some users about the previous test that I carried out uh, being not very fair because it's not synthetic. So, I don't have any numbers. Yeah, people caught up in the numbers game. Kind of disgusting, really. Uh, I don't have some solid numbers to actually compare it to... Uh, some other phones. So basically what I did was to download Antutu Tester and did a battery test with it. So what the Xperia S scored is 466 points. Now where that stands in the battery score ranking is below the Moto Milestone and Incredible S which are single core phones and it even stands above the Galaxy SL, the, the Motorola Defy, and well, even the older HTC HD2, which are all single, fo single core phones. Now, what stands out about this is that it's got be better battery life compared to the Galaxy S2 and the LG Optimus 2X, despite them being lower clocked overall in terms of their clock speed. Uh, and the ones that surpass it are not just the single core phones, and but the tablets as well. But this is natural, considering how big the battery capacities for tablets usually are. So, alright, back one step. 466 points. An interesting comparison to be made over here will be the Motorola Droid Razor. So, over here, I just go inside and head over to Antutu Tester. What I have for the battery test on the Motorola Droid Razor is 311 points. Now back one step and into the battery score ranking, that's all the way at the bottom. So given the scores though, the, let's see, the Xperia S should have approximately about 150% the battery life of a Razer. And since the Razer Max has almost double the battery capacity of the Droid Razer itself, the battery life of the Xperia S lies probably somewhere in between. Uh, the Droid Razer and the Droid Razer Max. Now, an interesting comparison to be made is with the uh, Xperia Arc S running ice cream sandwich, okay? So, uh, it's in between the Galaxy S2 and the LG Optimus 2X, although you can't really tell, uh, all the bars look the same, but the score that it got is 408 points here on the Xperia Arc S running ice cream sandwich, beta. I'm just gonna guess and assume that it should have a battery, better battery life when the final version of Ice Cream Sandwich gets rolled out for it. But all in all, yeah, that pretty much wraps up this video over here, I guess. Thanks for watching.